Hello, my friends. It is one of my favorite times. I get to open officially, this one's halfway open, but I get to open officially the happy mail from the Stamps of Life. Who does not love happy mail? Am I right? I love to get the mail. In fact, Ken makes fun of me because one of my favorite things to do is go to the mailbox and get my mail. Uh, it's, I don't know why. And it's always fun to get happy mail. And like when my dog gets the bark box box, it's so fun. We sit down and we play with all the toys that are inside. Well, I bet you that's how you feel when you get your kit club. Are you ready? And your diehard club. Oh, I love this moment. I love this moment. It's awesome. Dun, 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 dun. What? Okay, are you ready? Handy dandy storage envelope. Now, of course, you get boring envelopes, but if you have the envelope liner die sets, these envelopes are now exciting. Am I right? I'm right. Now, let's look at the colors. And Stephanie's going to hold this up so she makes sure she's doing these right. Okay, we have ocean. No, that's not true. We have sea glass. We have ocean. We have kiwi. I want to make sure I'm saying this right. Artichoke. Cranberry. I know that one's cranberry. We have cloud. We have ginger snap. We have chocolate. And we have powdered sugar. You always need powdered sugar. But look at how gorgeous and rich this color palette looks. Hang on, let me hold it all up. Look at how rich, the, oh. This is a gorgeous color palette. Isn't that fun? So that is our color palette. That is our starting point. Now, oh, they surprised me with this one. Dina, I didn't know we ordered these. Oh my gosh, look at those. See, the problem is, is Ken doesn't bring this stuff home to me when they come in. <gasps> We did these a hundred years ago in black. Now we have the flowers in red. Hang on, I gotta open it for you. Look at these. Oh my gosh, is that gorgeous or what? It's a ribbon flower. I love those. Ooh, okay, I don't get to see any of these anymore. What the heck? Look at those. Diamonds, diamonds. We have them in, oh how funny. So we have them in clear red or cranberry. We have them in like the, ocean and I'm thinking that's probably supposed to be kiwi. Awesome. I love those. Fun. Oh, the words just because, which is fun. Stamp set. And it says, I'm here for you. Call me anytime you need a friend. Time to celebrate you. Sending a note of thanks. Happy birthday greetings. Where would I be without you? Isn't that sweet? Ooh, dang. Look. Look at, okay, I guess I no longer work at this place because nobody sends at home any samples now. Um, okay, we're opening these right now because I want to see how many you get. Oh my word, look how many you get. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight wood snowflakes. And these are big. These are, these are like silver dollar size. That's big. I mean, gosh, that's fantastic. Ooh, we're going to have fun with those. Okay. And oh, twine. You always need twine and ribbons so we're getting a ooh, a satiny uh, cloud and a ginger snap uh, i'm not ginger snap a uh, cloud chocolate gingham and an idea card of course because oh and you know what the samples oh pooey kenny the samples are over there i didn't i didn't have them darn it i don't have them but the samples are here they're cute kenny's gonna go get them for me now we get to look at the paper pad because the paper pad is awesome we're using this camera so you can go get them now if you want okay so they, I'm sorry, they're over and up. And see where it says kit in that bucket? This is kit. Now, here we have the just because. Oh, look at that. So those of you that have our club, hang on. I'm going to get those dies out. I got to find them now because I put them away. So those of you that are in our diehard club, okay, the diehard club, but that matches pretty Pine cones, and look at this fun starburst, that's new for us. Pine cones, there you go, look at that, look at that. You're gonna die cut those all out. I colored them for you already. Ooh, wood grain, happy holidays. <gasps> Snowflakes, ooh, lots of pine. Lots of pine cones, dots. 
Oh, cute little ribbons. Ooh, more snowflakes. Ooh, wood grain. Ooh, pine. And we're starting all over again. Isn't that fun? I know. I know it's awesome. Okay, so we're going to move that up to the side. Gold Club members, you already have these, so this coordinates with that. Now, what am I talking about? Okay, if you're in the stamp club, you got the stamps. If you're in the die hard club, you got the stamps and the dies that match. If you're in the kit club, you're getting all the things I showed you in this video minus this. If you're in the gold club, you're getting these and this. You save an extra $5 on the kit, and you get a 20% discount anytime you order on our website. I know. And we have cool things like this, remember, that you can die cut them if you need a fast, immediate card. Awesome. If you need a 30-second card. Okay. And you get a handy-dandy postcard to show you, and you get a nice box. Now, let's look at our samples that they made for me. Uh, ooh, this one's cute. Just because using our background snowflake die. Isn't that gorgeous? I love that. Then here's a cute one with our little girl. We're, with the, I'm telling you, I'm going to take that off and I'm going to keep them. You know what? Perfect for little girl barrettes. If you need little girl barrettes. Here's a fun one using our new die, that um, the, L, the ribbon edge die, which is really fun. And oh, here's another one with the ribbon edge die. And um, call me when you anytime when you need a friend. Isn't that fun? Oh, here's another one. Just because. Just because. I love it. I love it. Now, the best part about all of this now is I get to make a card. I get to make a card. It's not very often I get to sit down and make a card. So we're gonna move those down, get those out of the way, kind of make some room around here, people. Okay, first things first. Oh my gosh. Okay. I, every time I say that, you know what I think of? We fly American all the time. I'm like platinum pro now on American, but they always do their videos and the flight attendant video always says, first things first, let's buckle those belts. And I always say it. Okay. Uh, what are we doing here? People, we're going to make a card and I'm thinking we are going to use, I don't know if this is out yet. It's on my desk. And normally the die is right here. This is the most important die of your life because it makes the perfect A2 size card. So I don't think I need any, well, yeah, I kind of want, okay, I'm going to use this whole die. I hope this is out. If it's not, well, hopefully you got it on HSN. Just saying. Now, it'll be out soon if it's not. What we're gonna do is we're gonna grab this die because we're just gonna use the whole kit. And we're gonna grab, I'm thinking we have to do the red. Hang on, let me kind of get an idea of what my pattern papers are. Oh, hmm. Hmm. Hmm, I'm thinking. You know what? Okay, um, ooh, I'm gonna do a pine cone. Okay, so whoops, wrong one. So what we're gonna do is we're going to first die cut this and let's do the red. This is gonna make it pop. So I'm gonna make a winter themed card. Well, I say that and it's gonna end up being something else. So I'm not gonna tell you what it's gonna be because I don't know. So we're gonna run this through just like that. Now this makes the perfect A2 size card because how many times have you tried to cut a piece of card stock in half and the corners never line up? Well, guess what? Corners line up perfect, perfect. Okay, so what, now we have that. That's my card base. Now I'm going to take this piece. This is the uh, swirl. And we are going to grab... Um, hmm. I'm almost thinking we need to do a solid. I think we're going to do a solid. So let's use the artichoke. And before we do anything else, we're gonna grab some of our adhesive sheets. We're gonna peel this off because, why am I saying this? Because you do not want to try to add tape runner to this gorgeous die. Now, I'm not going, oh yeah I am. I have to trim it down because I'll mess up. When in doubt, trim it. Trim, trim. There we go. Now I know this is all a sticker. I'm gonna lay that down and I'm gonna lay my gorgeous die down and I'm going to lay the layering die down. Just like that, a little bit at an angle. Now, what else do we wanna do? I have to use this because that is way too gorgeous. And so I'm going to grab, oh, I totally know what I'm gonna do now. Oh, hang on. Okay, I'm totally not gonna do what I said I was gonna do. I'm totally changing this. So what I'm doing is I'm taking this off, I'm not gonna use that. I'm going to use just this die that's in the kit, lay that down, and I'm going to get, there it is, these other dies instead. 
Now this makes its own grid, which is really fun. So we're gonna lay this down, and I hope you can see this. Can you see this? Not yet. Okay, there we go. Lay that down, and we're gonna lay this down. We're gonna make a grid out of this. Check this out, people. Okay, so let me make sure I got that lined up. Perfect, perfect. And we're gonna run that baby through instead. This is going to make a fun background die. And you can mix and match this one if you want. Now, if you were gonna cut out a couple of these, I would highly recommend using washi tape to hold those dies in place. So you could just pick up one piece and then die cut a whole bunch. But I only needed one, so I only need one. So now, check that out. Isn't that awesome? Now, yes, I do wish now this had back uh, adhesive on the back. But I have these fun rectangles. We're just gonna put those off to the side. Now, what we also need to do is we need to grab these and we're gonna get some pattern paper. So let's get, I kinda think I want that one. Let's see. Ooh, no, no, you know what? I want to, oh, yeah, no, gosh. And you know what the hard part is, is you, I don't want to touch my pattern paper. I love it so much that I just want to keep it forever. And I don't want to use it. Let's use this one. Oh, it's so hard. The first, tearing the first sheet out is the hardest, isn't it? Because we don't, we want to keep it nice forever and ever and ever. So we're going to lay this down, but you know what? I think I am a little concerned that I don't want to use just that color. So I'm going to grab in some green because we need some green in here too. So I think what I'm going to do, oh yeah, I'm going to grab this one because I want to make sure I have enough green on this card. So what I'm going to do, check this out, you guys. I'm going to do two at the same time. Now, I don't have any issues with the patterns on here because they're not like perfectly straight or anything. So I can just lay those on and we're going to run those through. Now, any that I don't use for this card are extras and I'm going to put them back in this storage envelope. So next time I pull this out, I have them, right? So if I want to, I can use them. So now what I have here, because I have lots of rectangles. Let's put all this off to the side and let's grab this because this is our main event here. Now, first things first, let's buckle those belts and we are going to grab some adhesive. Now, normally you would put the uh, adhesive sheets on the back of this. That's why I have paper underneath me because you don't want adhesive everywhere. Okay. Ah, see? Oh, and then you deal with this, and oh my gosh. Okay. Ugh. Okay. So now what we have here is we have our cute little card base. And I want it to go this way. So I'm going to lay this down. But see, I made this grid. I didn't have to use both. I could have, you know, mixed and matched. So now I have my grid on there, and now I'm going to use my paper. So let's do this one here. See how these little rectangles fit in there? Whoa! Oh, double-sided paper. You know, it's 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 like a it's like a catch twenty-two because you love it, and then you're like, oh wait, do I want to use that side or this side? Or then you're like, oh, now I want to use that side instead. And oh gosh, decisions, decisions. So we're just going to use this. This is what I was originally planning. So we're just going to continue with this one. Okay. So now we have this one, just like that. And now what I want to do is we are going to die cut this. So I'm going to lay that down. Now, if you're not a die hard member and you can't do right, and you can't swing the idea of having, you know, an extra payment. Um, but just so you know, if you're in the kit club, the die hard stamps and dies would only be $20 more a month. Just saying. Okay. But you can always cut this out with scissors. Now, that's called fussy cutting. I call it fuzzy cutting because I can never do it. Uh, just saying, okay? Now, there's my cute little there. But lucky me, I have this and I can use these. That one doesn't fit, it's this one. So we're gonna use that to cut that out. Oh. And we're gonna line that up. And we're gonna line this one up. And we're gonna run this baby through, just like that. And oh, I can use a smaller cutting pad. So we're gonna lay this down, we're gonna run that through. Oh, I think that moved a little, that's okay. Run that baby through. Oh, that one really moved, hang on. Uh, that was just way too far out of control there, whoops. The nice thing about these cutting pads is they're clear so you can, oh, snapping to a magnet. There we go, oh, oh my gosh. Okay, that's gotta be it, that's gotta be good enough. Okay, running that baby through. And what do we have? 
We have some fun. Oops. We have a cute pine cone. Already colored. Oh! And we have some greenery. And we have some more greenery. There we go. There we go. Oh, look how cute that is. Now, we could cut out more, but we're not going to. Now, what are we else are we going to do? We are going to get some adhesive foam because we need to pop some of these babies up. Now, what you're going to do is when you use your adhesive foam for shaker cards, you're going to use the extra pieces for adhesive foam. Now, I just have a whole sheet. Don't use a whole sheet. You don't want to do that. Just use the little pieces, the scraps. Okay, so we're going to peel that baby down. Add that guy right there. And we're going to peel this one down. And add this one right there. And you can the nice thing about this is you can make the foam any size you want. We're going to add that one right there. And then the pine cone, I'm going to get tricky tricky. And I'm going to use two pieces. So I'm going to make it double double height. So we're going to grab this. How many, I know a lot of you have already gotten these scissors. We keep selling out. They're the best for ribbon. I am just saying. You got to go watch the video on me cutting the ribbon because it's like, it's like a hot knife through butter. It's amazing. So we're going to peel this up. I can feel a hair on me. Don't you hate when you can feel a hair on you? Oh my gosh. It drives me nuts. Okay. We're going to peel this up. Peel this up. And now we're going to add this little guy there. Oh wait, I want to add it like this because I have to find those diamonds. Where are the diamonds? Where are the diamonds? What? And we're gonna use these. Oh my gosh, oh there it is, I found it. Oof. Okay, and we're gonna add these. So we're gonna add, I want it kind of to go behind that, yeah. And so we'll just add two. Normally you'd add three, but we're just gonna add two because we're kind of hiding it. Uh, wait. And we got to add three. Oh, where are you going there, buddy? Come back here. Okay. So, oh, hey, 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 hey. You get over there. Dog thinks I'm talking to her. Okay, there. Cute. Okay. Now, what are we going to do next? Oh, my goodness. I think we're going to use the freebie die set that you got in your Die Hard kit. Season's Greetings. Now, where did that paper go? As the adhesive on the back, remember I did that. We're going to use that for the word season's greetings. And then for the shadow, let's just use white. Yeah, we need to bring some more white in. Okay, so we're going to bring some white in. And there we go. Now let's move those over there. Okay, so smaller cutting pad. Lay that down, run that through. Now that's a lot of blade under the season's greetings. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to run it back through. Now, do you have to? No. But why I do that is because I don't want to go poke, 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 poke. I just have it boom there, right? And that's just so much easier. It's just a better cut. So now I have my background. I have my season's greetings. How easy is this? This is fun. I could sit here all day and do this. Okay, oops, come on. Come on, baby. There we go. Okay. So now we're going to peel this back. It's funny, I was using the um, liquid glue earlier and my fingers are still sticky. <laughs> oh, and I got ink on my arm. I'm telling you, ink on my fingers. You know how it is, right? But that means we're having fun. So that's all that matters. Now, this, now can you imagine trying to add this to this? Oh, are you kidding? That would be a joke. Look how fun this is. So we are going to add these guys. Ooh, okay. Add these guys. Oops, move that up a little. Because we want it to be right there. Look at that. Seasons. Now where's greetings? Oh, there it is. Now the scraps that I always, always save, no matter what, are the ones that have adhesive on the back. So we're going to just put that off to the side because those are the important ones. Now some little scraps like, you know, this, I usually don't save. But... You know, definitely keep the ones that have the adhesive on the back because you never know when you're going to need them. Now, give that a flick. See, I just flicked it out and because I ran it through twice, it totally just did it. Now, normally I would probably um, ink these edges, but we'll just keep going here. 
And we're going to run this through, run this through. Look at this. My Die Hard members are so lucky. My Gold Club members are so lucky they got this die for free in their kit. Season's greetings. Now, we're going to add this. Let's see, right there. So we kind of don't see all, let's see. No, I think I'm going to do it right there. So we're going to add this. And you know what? We're going to go above that. Add that right there. And then to finish it off, because I feel like it's a little too heavy on the side. To finish that off, what we're going to do is we're going to grab some ribbon. Ooh, it might be nice to bring some gray in. Yeah, you know what? We're going to bring some gray in. So let's bring some gray in. We do have a little bit of gray on this. So what we're going to do is we're going to just get this. Look how fun this is. So fun. And we're going to tie this in a knot. Look at this. Watch. watch. Whoa! I know. Isn't that awesome? Okay, so we're going to lay that down. We're just going to tie this in a knot. This ribbon is so luscious. And we're going to just tie this in a knot. Tie this in a knot. Dun, 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 dun. And we're going to trim this down. Trim this one down. And look at how stunning this is. Seasons greetings. And the nice thing about this is the grid, you barely notice the grid, but you notice the grid, right? You just kind of see an extra something something back there. Write our message in there. Fantastic. Kit Club members, your kits are on their way to you. I cannot wait to see what you create. Make sure you upload the projects that you create to our website because our online gallery has lots and lots of fun ideas. If you're not in the club, we might have a couple of these left. We've been selling out recently of our kit clubs. So once they're gone, they're gone forever. But if you're a club member, you're pretty much guaranteed to get one. So jump in real quick. Okay, thank you so much and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.